Hi everyone. We're ready to go out on the trails here at Texas Horse Park and show you the beauty that eQuest gets to share. Miss Kim and Vegas are going to lead our trail ride and Roscoe and I are going to follow behind. Let's go. Our first journey is going to be on the Jim Griffin Trail. Jim was one of our volunteers who was very instrumental in helping us with the program. Um, he is a military veteran and we are proud to honor him by naming this part of the trail after him. You can see the beauty all around us in the forest. Part of our area at Texas Horse Park is made into paddocks so that our horses can go out during the day and enjoy the fine weather and beauty that is here. This is just one of our smaller paddocks. We're going to take a short tour through this part of the woods. There are many different trails that eQuest has through these wonderful Trinity River forests. This is just one small snippet of the beauty that we can share with our clients, our volunteers, and our horses. Here's another look at our paddocks. Oh, there's Dottie and Artie and Verdi, Remy, Susie, Amigo, out enjoying the day. Oh, there's Tez.
gonna head back into the woods, kind of, as part of our discovery trail, which is also um, a sensory trail that we can use during our riding lessons and during our physical and occupational therapy sessions that we talked about earlier during the slideshow. Out on the sensory trail, we have different obstacles and different things that we can look at and do. You can see the dancing pipes. So when the breeze blows, the wind chimes blow. That's the car wash. It gives the sensory input of going through and touching them. Up here on the trail, there's some sand and some bricks and two different kinds of stones. And as you'll hear, it makes different noises as we walk through it, but you can't feel that it gives different sensations to the horses and to the riders. So it's a little different feeling on the horse for the sensory input of our clients. We have a little round pen out here that we utilize as part of our equine facilitated counseling program. It's far away from everyday activities, unless someone's out on the trail. So we don't use the trail when we're doing counseling. A chalkboard that you can write on. And then there are a couple of bridges, a mailbox that you can get the mail out of, a beanbag toss. And during the summer, there's plants in the tires that draw butterflies at some times during the season. We also have a purple martin house that we hope one day has birds in it. It's relatively new to Equest and to the Texas Horse Park. So right now there's no birds that are part of it. Miss Kim's gonna go over this bridge in front of us so that you can hear the different sounds when we walk over the bridge. In front of a 